So here we have it, two brand new features on the latest Fire TV, Fire Stick, Fire TV Cube update for you guys. And I'm gonna challenge you right now, I'm gonna challenge you to watch this video and let me know in the comments if you knew about these updates and if you knew about these features, shall we say. So there's two features, I guarantee you don't know about both of them. So let me know as we go through them. Quickly before we look at them, do remember, if you're a regular watcher here, share the video for me, drop me that comment underneath and watch till the end. If you're brand new here, do remember to hit the subscribe button. As you'll see here, or here, we've got plenty of videos for you regarding your Fire Stick, your streaming devices. We've linked one underneath on setting up a Fire Stick and jailbreaking, and we've linked many other socials underneath. So do check them all out for us, but the main one is, for free, hit that subscribe button. So there's two features. One is amazing, but to make sure you've got the latest update, you're gonna to need to update your Fire Stick. So first you go to Settings, then you go to My Fire TV, then you go to About, check for updates, and get yourself updated to the latest version. So the version I'm working on today is Fire OS 7.6.2.4. Um, let me know if you're not on that version underneath as well. This is the version we're working on. So if you get to the point and you say, I haven't got those features, this is why. So make sure you've got it updated as far as you can go. And the first one we're going to look at is a feature regarding audio. Um, regarding audio sound levels where they're different on every app. And it can be really annoying. So you might be watching an app, you're watching a film, and then you swap to a different show or a different film, and the audio is really loud suddenly or really quiet suddenly. Or you might just be watching a film and you can't quite understand the dialogue. They've recently added some features for this, which will fix it. So if you go to your settings, go to display and audio. In here, under audio, you've now got advanced audio, okay? These two here are brilliant. So you've got volume leveler, sets a consistent volume level across your streaming content and apps. Please select to turn on volume leveler. The volume leveler is brilliant. So if you stream on one, and then stream on the next, that volume will be the same level. Dialogue Enhancer. Boosts the vocals to make it easier to understand the dialogue. So if you're hearing me and my dialogue isn't clear enough, you can now boost that dialogue, and that's brilliant. I know a lot of people who turn on subtitles because they can't quite make out the dialogue which is being spoken. So that's another one to try. So let me know if you knew about that one in the comments and turn it on as well. Get it turned on and let me know how you find it. I've now turned it on. I know the wife's going to love that feature. The next one is how Amazon has a feature that will tell you what you want to watch next. They will suggest what you want to watch next. And there's a whole almost like menu for you ready to recommend programs. Um, what you need to do is get your button and you push it and you will speak to your Alexa device. Um, and you will say, what shall I watch? Here is what is on TV this now. Feature, Wonders of the Monsoon started 42 These minutes ago on BBC Two. Started 12 you to watch. minutes ago on ITV. And a couple of things it's which tipping are point. On demand started for you 12. To watch. And this is taken from your um, your streaming activity. Honest. So if you've watched things like I've got, I don't watch a lot of live TV outside of sport. So things like this are probably very random. But I do like Tipping Point and I do like game shows. Um, One Tree Hill, not going to watch it. You know, there were a few options for you to watch there. Um, on demand, again, there's a few programs which are picked. These are on your official apps. Ray of the Last Dragon, never heard of it. May take a look at it. WandaVision, seen it, loved it. Legends, not seen it. Myth of Frozen Tale, Flora. You know, these are ideas, and this is them recommending, and they will change it daily. And they will also, at the top there, tell you a few ideas of what you could ask to find out what else you might watch. So you can be specific about the apps. So you can ask um, what sort of app you want to watch on and give it a try. What should you watch on ITV? What should you watch on Netflix? What should you watch at 8 p.m. tonight? What's on the, what football is on this weekend? Amazon is there to help you and Alexa is there to help you if you want it. And they are a couple of solid, good features on your device. Okay, solid, brilliant features on your device, to be honest. Obviously, there's a few others. They added in your applications. You have a few extra added recently. Manage installed applications where you can reorganize it. We did cover this feature a little while ago when they added it, but you can now change it to recency. 
So it will tell you things you've never used or things you don't use very often so you can uninstall them if possible, that sort of thing, okay? Mine's a bit rare because I've just reinstalled everything on this Fire Stick because I factory reset it. We did cover that one a little while. That came with the latest version of the updates as well. We did cover the What Shall I Watch recently, whether you guys have seen that, but the audio was definitely very new and that was brought to my attention from Tech Doctor UK. Definitely make sure you check out his channel as well. So before we leave though, if you can, do remember, comments underneath are important, letting me know if you knew about these features. And if you had seen Tech Doctor's video, you might have known about them. It'd be interesting to see who knew and who didn't. And if you are after a VPN, before you leave, a quick word from one of our partners. NordVPN is a partner of ours. NordVPN is there um, to help you stay safe online, help you stay safe on your Fire Stick, help you stay safe on your internet, help you stay safe on your mobile phone, your PC, connect all your devices via a NordVPN deal. We've got a cracking deal at the minute. It is an affiliated deal. Um, it does help support the channel. So if you wanted to support the channel, we don't have memberships. We don't take donations, but if you wanted to get yourself a VPN, which will help keep you safe, we get a little commission in return for that. So you're not just donating straight to us or anything like that. You're not just signing up to a membership with no return. You're buying yourself a VPN and at no extra cost, we get a small commission, which is brilliant. So you should stay safe online. I can sleep well knowing you're safe online and no one's um, adding malware in there or trackers and blockers because you're using your VPN. And we're getting a small commission, which helps us continue to do what we do here every day, which is bring you the great facts, bring you the great streaming content and keep you updated. Brilliant. And one last thing before you do leave, if you're interested in more support, more help when it comes to streaming, we do have a Discord channel that is linked underneath for you as well. The Discord is open to everybody to join. There's many channels in there from just general chat, help, advice. We talk about movies and watch to watch. We have a few fun bits about what you're eating. Uh, we have MEMS, we have self-promotion. So if you're a YouTuber, a gamer, and you want to advertise your streams, you can put it in there. Uh, suggestions, a bit of football chat. And then a bit further down, we've got the KODI chat. We've got the streaming apps chat. We've got all my gaming stuff. And you will get notified for all my videos, everything like that, directly through Discord, which obviously their notifications is a great backup for us. It's a great system for us. So if we lost everything, we still have access to you guys so you can interact with us. For our streaming videos and we will move to a new platform if we ever got shut down so it's a great backup really appreciate you guys joining in so i've been doc squiffy make sure you hit that subscribe button drop me your comments i'll be seeing you next week with a few more videos make sure you have subscribed so you stay up to date when they're ready turn on those notifications join our discord underneath and i'll see you soon